Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, we'll learn how we can get user location in React or using Jane JavaScript. So let's get started. So there are two ways to do this. The first one is to use an API. So uh, here we can see we have this API that is ipapi.co slash json. Now if we hit this API, it gives us our location and also the IP address. So what we can do is use access to hit this API and get the location. So let's do that. Here I'll just uh, use use effect to do this. So I'll just type in use effect and here we keep the dependency at a empty so that it works as componented mount. Now we'll have to create another function to get the location. So let's make another function. Let's say get location. So const get location goes to sync. Now what we'll do is we'll get the location from the IP. Let's say const location equals to await and let's use axios dot get and we'll just paste in the url that we got now once we got the location we'll set it to a uh, state so let's say const current location i'll just type in current location and set current location Now what we'll do is we'll just set the current location to location.data. That means we receive a data from this API that we are setting to this property. Now we'll just simply call this function in the use effect. Now we will just clear all the code that is already inside this and I'll remove the imports as well. And I'll remove the class name. One thing we forgot is to import the use effect. So I'll just do that. So I'll just import use effect from react. Now here let's print the location that we got. So let's have a h1 tag with location, then latitude and then longitude. Also the city name. Now let's just save this and check if we are getting the location or not. So I'll just save this and it is being compiled. So here it says we don't have use state and axios. So what we can do is we will just import use state as well and also import axios. We haven't installed axios. So what we'll do is we'll open a new terminal here and I'll just type in npm i axios. Now this command will install access package for us. So now this is installed. So let's check if it is compiled or not. Yeah, it is successfully compiled. So let's go and check in the browser. Here if we refresh, we can see that our current location is 22.518 latitude and 88.3832 as longitude. If we just go to the network tab and refresh, here we'll get this API call here and here you can see all the details that was provided by the API. So this was one method. So the only drawback for this method is that sometimes the API doesn't work. In that case, the location won't be fetched. The second method is to use the geolocation property of JavaScript. So let's go and do that. Now here I'll add in a new function. Let's say const geolocation js and then create a new function and then here what we'll do is we'll just type in this command navigator.geolocation.get current position now it will give us the position which contains the quads that contains latitude and longitude so what we'll do is We'll just uh, set another variable here. We'll copy this 
एंड करेंट लोकेशन जे एस सेट करेंट लोकेशन जे एस ना वट विल डू इज विल कॉपी दिस सेट करेंट लोकेशन जे एस एंड विल जस्ट पुट इट इन हियर नाउ विल गेट द लैटिट्यूड एंड लॉन्गिट्यूड सेव्ड इन दिस वेरिएबल नाउ लेट्स ऑल्सो कॉन्सो लॉक द पोजिशन हियर सो दैट वी कैन गेट अ बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ वट द ऑब्जेक्ट एक्चुअली लुक्स लाइक सो आई जस्ट कॉन्सो लॉक the position here and then call this as well in the use effect and also what we can do is we can have a new uh new header that says current location js we can add in the latitude and we can add in the longitude as well now if you are wondering how am i getting this kind of auto suggestion that is because i am using github profile it auto suggests code so let's see how it is working now i'll save this and here we can see uh, we are also getting the location from the js locator now if we check the console what we'll see is we have the geo location object here it only gives us the latitude and longitude the only drawback of this is that we only get the latitude and longitude not the city or other details so these were the two options how we can get user location in react or in plain javascript if you got value from this video do hit the like button and for more such insightful content do subscribe to this channel thank you for watching